I'm Trace Leong. This is a WJZ 13 at your desk update. Police are looking for a gunman involved in a fatal shooting on Christmas Day. Officers were called at the 300 block of Bigley Avenue in Lansdowne for a report of a shooting. When they arrived, they found a 25 year old man with gunshot wounds. He was rushed to the hospital where he later died. Police are searching for two people in connection with a deadly home invasion in Baltimore City. Police say a 21 year old woman was shot in the head in her home in the 3600 block of Lindale Avenue on Thursday. Investigators say the suspects forced their way into her home and shot her before running away. New details in the investigation of the tanker truck explosion that triggered a massive pileup on an ice covered I-95. Officials say the driver of that tanker truck had all the required certifications to drive the vehicle. MTDA police say 31 year old Clinton Lamont Worrell also had a valid medical certificate. The company also released a statement saying Worrell has an outstanding employee. Two people died and dozens were injured in this nearly 70 car pileup. A community comes together after a devastating fire. The two alarm fire broke out on Circle Terrace Apartments in Baltimore County Friday, sending two young girls to the hospital and displacing dozens of families just before Christmas. The local Toys R Us then offered donated toys to the local fire department, who then distributed the gifts to the families in need. WJZ 13 is always on. Tune into Eyewitness News today at noon, 4, 5, 6, and 11. For the latest on those stories and for constant updates, stay right here with CBSBaltimore.com.